Burma, also called Myanmar, is one of the most ethnically diverse countries in the world. More than half a million refugees from Burma are living in camps in nearby countries such as Bangladesh, India, Malaysia, and Thailand. To date, the United States has resettled approximately 5,000 Burmese refugees, many who have found homes in Kansas. There are eight major ethnic tribes in Burma and over 100 distinctive subgroups. The majority who has resettled in America are from the Karen ethnic group. Some cultural considerations when working with the Karen people to remember include the Karen people use names and nicknames. There are no first and last names. It's typical for a Karen to walk behind those who are their seniors. And finally, remember that saying no is a way for the Karen to be modest, and modesty is highly regarded. So, no may not necessarily really mean no. The majority of Karen are Christian, but there are also Karen who practice Buddhism, Islam, and animism, which is the worship of nature. The other two major ethnic groups that have immigrated to the United States are the Burmans and the Chin. Most Burmans practice Buddhism and also retain many animistic beliefs. The Chin are predominantly Christian. This video features Father Chrysostom Amang, who came to Kansas on a religious visa and serves as a priest in four churches in southeast Kansas. My name is Father Chrysostom Amang. I came from Burma. I came to the United States in 1994. Mostly I'm in southeast Kansas area. I like this country. I enjoyed my life as a priest here. I would like to share the people here about my country, our culture, our people, our children from our country. We have school in every village, primary school. When the town is become bigger, we have the high school in the towns. In every state, we have the college right now. But I mean, the system is quite different from here and in our country. Even the way they are going to the class, I was quite surprised. In our country, the teacher will be moving from class to class. Here the students are moving from class to class. Like in our country, only the university and colleges, the students are moving from class to class. The teacher will remain. That is the highest standard. But in our country, we are like before. The students are moving from class to class. The teacher will be in the same room. Then the children, they like to learn. They like to, but sometimes they cannot go because of the poverty, because of the parents. The buildings are not good, but the children will go to school. Usually the school hour is from 9 to 4, the whole day. The children will be at the school. But sometimes the schools are a little bit crowded. But we have so many children in Burma. I told them, sometimes some villages, maybe three, four hundred, that is small villages. Then in, even in the town and city, after the school hours, the whole town you will see there only the students with the white shirts and green, that is the uniform. So you will see everywhere. There are so many children in Baba. For the teacher here, I think whatever they teach, the children will take it. But maybe a little bit slow in the beginning because they are eager to learn something. So whatever the teacher tell them they will do. Maybe easier for the teacher because our culture is teachers and parents are at the rank of something like in the family of God. So after God, parents and teacher, so they have to listen, they have to obey the teacher. Whatever the teacher tell them they will do. They go to school, at least they finish their primary 
school in the villages to go to the higher school, middle school or high school, depend on their family background. If they can support, they can go. Primary, you don't need to pay. Usually, state school, you don't need to pay. But you have to spend a lot of money for the books and everything. So that costs a lot. To go to college is very expensive. So they cannot go to college. But there are some still going. Bahama, the families are very close to each other. Because I told the people here, we stay together. Usually, sometimes parents, grandparents, all the children. We are in the same place, same building. We were very close. The people are very close. Bamba is a good country. I mean, regarding to the resources and everything, because people are very welcoming. They like the foreign, I mean, stranger. In general, they are very good. We have the primary language is Bamis. Then we have eight major tribes and eight major dialects. But there are so many small dialects, maybe 300, 400, so many. But we have eight major tribes and eight major dialects. The common language is Bamis. In Kansas, mostly northeast and southwest. That is around Kansas City area and Garden City area. There are, I think, in Kansas City area, maybe about 70 family. Then Garden City too, maybe the same. Around Garden Plain, Garden City, they are working at the meat plants, Tyson. And Garden, Kansas City, I don't know where they are working. Whatever job they get, they will do. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Kulo kwe tampi chang kwe lumio chang go wenga yare tu chao mai Jesus temar da blue do malo 